Prairie Land Art Conference is a um, it's a one-day art show competition, and there are 16 schools that can be involved. This year we had 14, which I believe is the most school we've had out of the conference for a long time. So we're just missing two schools this year. Um, each school can bring 10 students and 50 pieces of artwork. The judges go around, and each one takes a category, and they will judge that category. They give out five ribbons per category, and at the end, the judges um, they get to talk and pick the best of show between them, so they kind of fight over for the best of show piece. They love coming to the show. I think it's kind of humbling for them to see what other schools are producing and what other kids are producing, the creative ideas that are coming out. Um, it's just, it's phenomenal to see what high school kids can come up with and what they can create. And so they love being able to vote for their pieces. Well, when I walk around and I look at the, the talent and the creativity in, in the high school student work that we're, we're seeing today, um, it, it's a mixture of things. I'm very excited just to see the, the level of talent that we have right here in central Illinois. I'm also very, I think, proud and appreciative of our art instructors at those schools. Um, certainly students have raw talent, but that talent, just like in athletics or any other area, can be wasted if not given the proper direction. And we are very, very fortunate to have great leadership in those art positions. Many of those art teachers are even Spoon River College alumni, which makes us even you know, more appreciative and proud. Really the greatest aspect of this is getting our students involved and letting them show the high school students what Spoon River College is like and what our classes are like. So um, we have three students, all of them um, from the graphic design, art, and theater areas and they're teaching each workshop. So we have 15 all together, three at each workshop and really they're kind of uh, telling our story. They're the ones that are, are really putting Spoon River College out there. This is my grandma, or my grandma and my grandpa, and this was uh, painted from the last picture taken of my grandpa before he passed away. Um, he was in, he was in the nursing home, and I took my phone out because I, I thought this was a cool moment, and I just snapped a picture with my phone and I painted it.